future of healthcare, utilizing Homeboy as an example. And quickly, uh, I think we regress to where the co-production, co-creation uh, group was. So we talked a lot about uh, co-designing. So instead of saying, you know, as we are often thought of as the experts, uh, here's what you need. We're going to actually go out and ask people what they need. And so we're going to go through a process. And that's what we developed is the process of co-design. And so looking at asking the right questions um, and maybe even co-developing the questions with the communities that we're serving. We talked about segmenting the communities so that we look at uh, people who are who don't access the healthcare system currently, people who infrequently access the healthcare system, and then those folks with chronic conditions that access very frequently. And looking at what the different, and, and oftentimes, what is the same about the questions and concerns they have about healthcare. So that was uh, kind of the who that we talked about. Then we went in uh, to the, the what space. So what do we need to co-design? And we talked about everything. And it's just not the care delivery model, again, which we are most familiar with. It really is about health improvement overall. <clears throat> and that could be everything from nutrition, uh, which we really don't deal with all that much, at least in the American healthcare system, uh, to actually the delivery of care. And again, talking to the people who need this care about what that looks like. So ask questions about what's impacting your health. Um, what could impact your health? What role would you, like to, would you like us to play? So again, we always put ourselves out as the experts. And we usually take a, you know, we're in the driver's seat for healthcare. And maybe we need to take a back seat and let others drive and us support what they're doing. And then what matters to you that we just don't get? So again, we, we think that we know what people want and what matters to them, but we never ask the question, what really matters to you? And we're just blind to it. So that was kind of the what that we talked about. And then we talked about the how. How do we begin the process of co-design? And so in the first week, we plan. We plan to convene uh, pulling these people together and to have this discussion. And that's everything from identification of uh, the right people uh, to how do we start to test. And then we look at, in our next month, actually convening. And so we pull people together and we go through a process of identifying the problem together. So that is all the people in the community and the people that profess to be in healthcare identifying what the problem is. And then together we identify what the aim is. And then we go through a process in lean of working through an A3. And that is identifying the gaps, doing rapid experiments, coming up with the solutions. And then finally, in our uh, six months, it's about implementing and communication. So how do we communicate what we come up with to the rest of the, the provider community as well as the community at large? So that was our idea. Actually, no concrete uh, what the future looks like, but actually talking to people to design what it looks like. Mm -hmm. Any questions that I can deflect to? <laughs> <laughs>